Hello everyone and today with me is the Uri cast. Hello everybody. Hello, hello. So Vicky, you've met uh, the Prime Minister. How was it? It was good. It was, it was an honor to meet him. Uh, and uh, yeah, it was good. It was good. Yeah. Like a shy boy, you're just like, did you talk about Uri? Did you talk about uh, your film? Did you ask him to watch it? Yeah, so he knew that uh, there's a film coming up, Uri. There was one day before the release that I met him. And uh, he was curious to know that how, uh, you know, the director uh, thought of making a film on that. And uh, he uh, gave his best wishes to the team. And uh, yeah. And it's fine. He hasn't watched it yet. He's seen a few minutes of the film. That's okay. what, I mean, that's that's how much time he gets to watch films so he only manages to take out few minutes for films so he's seen few minutes and uh, some rushes of the film and mm. uh, he was uh, very appreciative about it and uh, he gave good wishes to the team right so uh, the movie is out the reviews are great everyone's performance is being appreciated how do you feel it's your first film like this oh i feel on the top of the world right now i couldn't have asked for more you know when i look back right now i waited for quite a, a long time for this moment but uh, it's eventually come and it's come like in with flying colors. I couldn't have asked for more. I'm really excited and happy. What do you have to say? I have to say that the Josh is very high, sir. All because of you, the audience, who's given so much love to the film, so much appreciation. And uh, it's, it's a very blissful feeling to know that they've really connected with the, uh, with the essence of the film, uh, you know. And uh, yes, it feels good, good as a team. Intelligence officer, what <laughs> do you have to say? Uh, a crore, a crore business uh, uh, It's a See, a crore movie high. All, all time high. <laughs> okay. uh, all I like to say is that um, we, we were to get this kind of a response, to get this kind of a roaring response on day one itself. I think it is, it's very unreal. Uh, but it, it's happened, and we're still absorbing it. You know, like a lot of times, what happens is people do think. Are they trying to show what actually went down? Was that the fight? Were you actually trying to show what went down? Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. We've tried to make it uh, as authentic as possible. And whatever cinematic liberties of any sort we've taken, uh, keeping uh, certain protocols in mind. Uh, and it's also a film at the end of the day for, for, for the mm -hmm. audiences to watch. So certain, um, certain things could be classified uh, for security reasons. But apart from that, everything has been run through uh, the army, hmm. the entire script was 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 run through them, and uh, so there's nothing which has been shown in the film which is not monitored or which has not come through army's validation. Playing an uh, army officer is, is a huge responsibility. I very clearly remember uh, that when we Vicky and me we were training, and one of the soldiers came to me and he said, you know, we were just we had finished the uh, the day and we were just chilling, and he just came and he said, uh, please remember one thing: you are going to portray us in front of the entire nation. So whatever you guys do is put what they're going to put, put, put your act together. So yeah. that was something really we we felt that I personally I felt that uh, you know it was it was a very heavy statement and we had to be more responsible and I think that has. So been you happened. know whenever you make a movie on the Indian Army, the one thing that can go wrong and also is the high point of the movie is the nationalism factor. And there's a very thin line between nationalism and jingoism. So uh, do you feel? At any point, was that your motive that if someone sees a scene, they feel like they should feel a nationalist spirit, that I'm a patriot, I mean, I should go to my heart in my heart. Was that a feeling thi, or was it a task for you to keep it subtle in the movie? No, um, it wasn't so animated. <laughs> Sorry. But it's <laughs> No, no, I'll tell you what. <laughs> no, no, I'll, te I'll tell you. Um, when I'd uh, just taken the narration and I'd read the script and I finally when I met Aditya and and um, I, I told him I really want to be on board. Um, there's a very important thing which he said, which is which is why my my respect and my understanding of this film uh, grew also by many folds. Mm. He said, I want to make a film which not just the audiences love, but the army is extremely proud of. Mm. And that was the seed which went in making Uri. That is the emotion with which we all came on board and that because he shared this with everybody. Right. Everybody on set was aware of the sentiment. Everybody worked keeping that in mind because that is what the captain of the ship, his mm. intention was. And um, um, Jingoism has become a friend in promotions. Trust me, just the word. <laughs> but uh, Major Vihan is nicely motivating people in the movie and saying like, Ghar mein jaake and you know, all of that is Not going people. on. people. So you have to see it in a different lens. 
वो चौराहे पे खड़े होकर नॉर्मल लोगों को नहीं बोल रहा कि खून का बदला खून से लेंगे यू नो दे नॉट इवन डिस्कसिंग दैट ओवर ब्रेकफेस्ट ही इज टॉकिंग एंड चार्जिंग अप अ ट्रूप हु आर जस्ट रेडी टू गेट ऑन टू द चॉपर्स एंड रिस्क देर लाइफ टू गो अक्रॉस बॉर्डर एंड डू द मिशन एंड कम बैक तो ऐसे मौके पर ऐसे सिचुएशन पे दे नीड दैट बूस्ट एंड एज अ कमांडिंग ऑफिसर ऑफ दैट टीम ही नीड्स टू गिव दैम दैट बूस्ट सो दैट वेन दैट वेन दैट यू नो टाइम कम्स वेन दे हैव टू डू द डर्टी चॉप ऑफ पुलिंग द ट्रिगर फॉर द कंट्री दे आर नॉट क्वेश्चनिंग देर ओन कॉन्शियंस दे आर नॉट वो एक सेकेंड का भी पलक ना झपके यू नो सो यू हैव टू लुक इन टू इट इन अ मच लार्जर परस्पेक्टिव दैन जस्ट वॉट द लाइन इज सेंग यू नो एंड विच आई एम वेरी ग्लैड दैट वॉट पीपल आर सींग द एंटायर फिल्म इन द एंटायर टी दे आर गेटिंग द कॉन्टेक्स्ट वेल and uh, my last question is going to be that you know um, every time a movie comes out especially like indian army pe movie bani hai to uh, there are talks of how much role is the woman getting you know is the character underwritten i read a few reviews and they actually said that you know yummy's character as the intelligence officer is slightly underwritten are you taking it with a pinch of salt or are you thinking about it i'm i'm all sugar with my <laughs> with my centurion <laughs> i'm all sugar because that's what we are getting from the audiences it's all sweet love and uh, you know it's very it's not to anybody in particular any reviewer but i genuinely feel i genuinely genuinely feel that uh, especially people who are writing it out there uh, they uh, they need to have a bit of a of course the sense of cinema that they have i can compare myself with that but as an actor i can definitely say a lot of hard work goes mm. uh, a lot of hard work goes not in just performing a character but even looking out for uh, a certain good roles mm. it's not easy mm. and i would definitely say that pallavi sharma is one of been one of the best roles that i've been uh, part of or i got to portray and uh, i was very much aware of the role that i'm going to have and i'm extremely proud and happy that this role came my way and uh, i portrayed and the kind of love i think i'm getting the film is getting from the people from the audiences i think that's that what mat- that's what matters to me a lot right thank you so much for speaking with us 8 crore se 800 crore tak pahunch jaye good luck thank you thank you so much thank you.